In this video, I will show you the different sources of help you can get in Euclid Cloud and how to report an issue by creating a support request to ECA when using our services. ECA has made available several layers of help and support across the Euclid Cloud services. To start with, when open the Euclid Cloud for the first time, a user journey briefly guides you through some key features of the application. Other user journeys will also appear in other places of Euclid Cloud when you access them for the first time. We recommend you to go through them. Question marks are a synonym of help and support in Euclid Cloud. You will find them in different places, providing different type of help. First, let's take a look at what we call field level help. Field level help is available in all sections of a substance in edit mode. This help is made visible by hovering over the name of a field and the help content is displayed by clicking on the question mark next to the field. It provides information on the purpose of the field and helps you enter the correct information. To hide the help text, click again on the question mark. If you decide to launch the Euclid Cloud Client to edit your substance, the full Euclid Sys help system will be available there and can be accessed by pressing F1 on your keyboard. You may have noticed this other question mark on the top right corner of the screen. This opens the Euclid Cloud functionality manuals, which contains a high level summary of all functionalities available in Euclid Cloud. This manual is available in all EU languages in the ECA Cloud Services webpage. I will show you that in a moment. Another source of help and support is available in the cloud bar. Here you have a direct access to your Q&As, uh, which contains practical questions and answers about different aspects of the services. You will also find here a link to our YouTube channel, where we upload new video tutorials regularly about how to use the different functionalities of Euclid Cloud. But there are two additional links in this menu. This one takes you to the ECA Cloud Services webpage, and this other one allows you to contact ECA Help Desk for support. Let's take a look at them in detail. The ECA Cloud Services webpage contains information about the services available and links to the Q&As, video tutorials, webinars, and other relevant pages. At the bottom of this page, you can find the Euclid Cloud Functionalities Manual, the Euclid Cloud Presentation, which is ready for you to promote and talk about the cloud services and also the terms and conditions for using the cloud service. All these documents are translated in all EU languages. The ECA Cloud Services webpage is actually also translated in all EU languages, and you can change the language easily here. In case you have difficulties in using the service or you need help, you can contact our help desk via the support request form, which is also accessible here in the cloud bar. To submit your request, you need to indicate if it's a question or a problem, and the category, if it's technical, business, or security related. Describe in detail the issue and then click Submit. When your, our help desk receives your request, you will receive an email with a ticket number. For any further communication with ECA on this topic, remember to always include the ticket number for reference. 